and then we'll go north, a little south, and then it's a beeline back. So this is actually the roads are a little crappier, but I'm still maintaining about 22, 23. So can't complain. And there's a group ahead of me that I'm kind of trying to catch. Not real serious yet. Got a long way to go. So. pacing me. I guess not. Still closing in on the pack. There's about 14 riders in that one. I don't know if they're the lead pack, but having a good ride so far. Really good ride. We're heading north and playing around the 25 to 27 mile per hour. The road isn't the greatest, but it's not bad. Even the lousy chip seal from last year was uh, smoothed out quite a bit, so it should be a pretty good one. Uh, last year I did this one at uh, 21. Point nine on my old Baron, and I'm going to see if I can break that with this one. They're getting closer. I caught up to them, and they stopped at the rest stop. Ah, I got one back here. It's all that's left out of 15 riders. That was kind of funny.
7. 64.7 miles. About 1,600 feet of total climb. So I wasn't quite as fast as I was last year, but it was a good, good ride, very fast. And I beat this guy. Hey TJ, why don't you tell the world which route you took? Did you do? 40. There you go, you pushed yourself, I'm proud of you. I was, I was, I just turned on the camera and I said, I said, uh, I have a lot of people who are gonna pass me, but I got you. I thought I, I just turned it on because I was gonna show you, but I got you. I said as long as I got Mark, 